lockdown at Leighton Moss. One day later, there'd have been no young woman with purple hair greeting us in the visitor's centre, telling us how the booming bitterns could be heard somewhere along the lower trail past Lillian's hide. In the cafe, the smell of sanitizer is a warning sign of another visitor. Nervous at the sight of a man touching his face while he stacks the coffee cups, we escape outdoors to walk between the reed beds, basking in the wide open of it all, as everything else is closing down. Then, out of the expanse, we hear the low moan of a bittern's call. It echoes from untraceable directions, lands in the pivot of my pelvis, my centre of gravity, a grounding place in the shifting uncertainties. Soon enough, this place will be off limits, but today, lost in the thrill of the bittern's mating song, I raise my binoculars and watch a marsh harrier soar.